For years, people have tried to prove the existence of Nessie the Loch Ness Monster, and so far, no one has been successful. But this might all change soon because the master of searches, Google, has now joined the hunt. So for those of you who really want to go monster searching, but don't actually want to go to Scotland or actually get into that cold, murky water, Google now has made it possible for you to do so from the comfort of your own home. Because Google has taken its street view cameras on and under Scotland's most famous lake. According to Google, they're doing this to celebrate the anniversary of the iconic surgeon's photo taken in 1934. This photo that was published by the Daily Mail that kicked off the monster legend showed what appeared to be a giant sea creature raising its neck out of the water. And of course we know that this photo turned out to be just a toy submarine with a head and neck made of wood in an elaborate hoax. But you know despite what Google says, the reason for them to join the Loch Ness monster hunt may not be so innocent. Because Google is trying to take over the world you know. So I have two theories. The number one theory is that if you didn't know, Google has a full size T-Rex skeleton looming at their Mountain View campus. And I'm thinking maybe Google feels that T-Rex is just not big enough for that company and they want the skeleton of the Loch Ness Monster. My second theory is that they just want to strap a camera onto the Loch Ness Monster and then, uh, you know, just stream the whole thing live on YouTube. But to be honest, yeah. I would watch that. Anyway, to get these photos, Google decided to create street view bolts and also employ a team of divers to snap photos beneath the lake's surface. These images taken both above and below the surface of the water are available to view, and I do have the links of those photos in the description box below. Also, take a look at this, guys. In this particular photo, there looks to be some logs or something floating on the water, so of course, some people thought that Google might actually have snapped a photo of the Loch Ness Monster. Personally, they just kind of look like driftwood. But let me know what you guys think. Also, give me your theories about why Google is now looking for the Loch Ness Monster. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. See you later.